Welcome to the part two of this hard drive destruction test. Um, in the last part, to be honest, I thought the hard drive was dead. I didn't think it had much left in it. So I just hammered it to bits, but I've since decided that it actually does, because I plugged it back into the computer with this handy USB hub, so I can have it over here. And if I plug it in this way, it goes. So first of all, I'm going to take this hard drive, a Seagate one, which doesn't actually still work, sounds awful though. I might demo that later on. And I'm going to just drop it. Three, two, one. Well, that was easy. To think this used to hold the date of a PS3, and it also used to hold my keeping up appearances on this fire gel at a disc. So whilst the debris is all still there, let's just plug it back in. That seems like the only sensible thing to do. Um, plugging in. Oh, it appeared to be jammed. That's still trying to go. So let's poke it with the screwdriver. Oh. Hard drive drop test part two. Three, two, one. Then plug it from the hard drive, plug it back in. He's getting stuck. So just poor build quality here. Right, what's getting that stuck? She doesn't seem to want to go at all. So I'll just need to hit it with this hard drive again. Plug it back in. <laughs> I'm gonna need to get the Hoover again. There you go. Oops, I panicked. I can't even see it with my eyes in high quality, so you see that on the camera just as good as I'm seeing it with my own eyes. Hard drive drop test in three. I think we'll go this down this time. This way. Three, two, one. Okay, that sounded interesting. Throwing stuff at me. Come on. That's crazy. Oh, this is insane, this V1. That one wouldn't smash at all, and this one's disintegrated. Take 
this wee rubber band. Unplug it, plug it back in. Just not want it to go. Unplug it. So it can't support that. The wee arm is still trying to move. Probably we think there's no idea what it's doing. Just smash this thing to bits. Oh! Now that that arm is sufficiently destroyed, this is actually starting to come apart at the bit where it connects to the power supply here, which is a, a USB port. Still gone though. Oh, you're joking, that wee spindle still works. Enough. Stop at you. Now this orange wire looks like it might be of importance. So I plug this back in. I'll remove my screwdriver from that and see if the spindle this wee thing does anything. Oh, no, this is smashed. That snapped. It's trying to go. Can you... Is it, is it magnetic? Okay. So many screws are all getting totally stuck in this. Now, here we go. Death by hard drive. So, one hard drive and another hard drive. Who's gonna win? This wee bit in the middle is hard to hurt. Oh, it's gotten jammed. Let's come off all okay, here we go. Oh. That's still spinning. Sounds so awful. Don't know if you can hear that.
Oh, this is all disintegrating down this end of the hard drive. Look at that. Oh, I'm not sure if that'll plug in again. Will that? Oh, come on. In you go. Yes. Where's my... Here it is. I can put this on. No, it's not taking that. This is hard to completely break. Finally. Stop me then. Oh, that took a sweet time. Oh. Yeah, just falling apart over here again. Oh. I don't know how to break this at this stage. Keep hitting it. Right, so I've upgraded my, I, uh, my artillery to a hammer. I'm going to go and try the other side for a change. Let's just put a ton of weight for it. Here we go. This power connector is just getting all kinds of mangled up. <sighs> okay, that's now totally broken. There you go, so that's how you break it. <laughs> the hard drive wouldn't give up, but the power connector did. Yes, I can plug it in here. No, that's it done. Look at that, it's just all broken off now. So that's the condition of our hard drive now. Now, now it's just getting bent up. So yeah, I think that is it I'm truly gone now. So that's the end of part two and also the end of this hard drive. So I'll see you in the next one. This is what this big battered old hard drive is like when it's plugged in. Stopped when I push that down too hard. Oh. 
So this is effectively an off switch here. Push this bit down to get it to... Push that down to stop it, and then it will go on its own.